I'm Professor Susan Short. I specialise in treating adult patients with brain tumours and the Brain Tumour Charity have asked me to summarise for you some of the issues surrounding the recent COVID-19 outbreak. So according to the government guidelines, any patient who is on or has recently had chemotherapy within the last three months is considered a high risk case. This obviously applies to some of you, but by no means to all of our brain tumour patients. For those of you who finished treatment several months ago, we wouldn't expect you to have significant problems with the uh, immune system. We'd advise all our patients and their carers to follow the government advice in terms of personal hygiene, hand washing, etc. and seek advice through um, NHS 111 if you develop COVID-19 like symptoms. For our patients who are currently on treatment or have recently finished treatment, uh, we would advise them to contact their specialist team at the treating hospital. All of these hospitals will have plans for how to test, diagnose and manage patients who may have COVID-19 infection. The other thing to say is that a lot of hospitals are considering reducing outpatient appointments, uh, particularly for patients who are not on active treatment. So if you are on follow-up and are only having regular um, scans and surveillance appointments, you may be invited to a telephone or video uh, conference appointment rather than attending uh, outpatients. The advice from NHS England and government is changing quickly. Uh, the information on the website will be updated as soon as uh, the advice significantly changes. Please keep an eye on all sources of helpful advice.